Warning, the following segment is rated MA. Actually, what's that R? It contains nudity, coarse language, drug and sexual references, and two morons in a plastic cylinder. Enjoy. Magic Round 2023, done and dusted. Yes, and what a weekend it was. Two days in a perspex cage of emotion in one of the wildest pubs in Queensland. You know, our crew got up to Brisbane early to set up our snug little home in our Caxton Hotel car park. Snug? It's f***ing tiny. It's like Matthew Johns' wallet. So, with our cage in position and the footy about to start, we arrived into pure f***ing hell. Hating every single moment of the start, weren't you? I want to sit down, you. It started. What do you reckon, Nathan? What do I reckon? A stupid idea. Yeah. Tell me about it. It's so bad. It's one of the worst things I've ever seen. Would you say the crowd was animated? Animated. They punched a hole in the perspex bloody screen at the start. First two minutes. Dog supporter. Bang. Hey Ben. Great idea, you By the way, when you idiots were designing this, who came up with the bright idea of not having a roof? Leon. F***ing useless Leon. At least the crowd agreed with us. <laughs> because he's useless, we copped a barrage of crap coming over that wall. <laughs> I'm out. Throwing foreign objects in here. That. I've got a little bit of a collection. What's going on? This came earlier during the day, <laughs> and uh, it's, it's still warm. I must admit that sausage did come in handy, though. <laughs> <laughs> we had some great guests coming to the cage. We did. None more important than Stephen Beaver Menzies. He basically made it a, a signing booth for all his fans. Now you're turning this into a f***ing signing session. Big Jarrell Yell Ye made an appearance. Yep. Oh, God. Hey, you've got Big Kahuna in. Oh, yeah. Right. Big cheese. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, he was chirpy, all right? No, he was a punish. Watch me mongrel boots. Hello, it's Andrew Updow here. I want to congratulate you all and thank you for being a part of Magic Round. That was good to see Matty Nable as well. It was. Hey, mate. Uh, hey, mate. mate. No, 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 I think I'll just sit on the end. I don't think he was oh. too keen on Maddie's Johnny Cash covers. I fell into a burning flame of fire. It went down, 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 and the flames burned higher. Gordy was the best guest. Rocks in, plays up with the crowd, straight into a shoey. Queensland's raging ball. It's good it was free. True. There was a fair bit of loose drinking around that cage for two days. Really? Well, I didn't think so. So you don't think drinking out of a boot's weird? Or two cans at once? <laughs> or sculling a schooner through a green wolf suit? Or the bloke you made stripped down to his underwear just for a couple of shots of tequila? And then you made him drink the dregs? And I think then you made him lick the tray. Oh, everyone loves licking the tray. No one licks the tray. We do. You do. What about that loose unit that sculled a beer out of the condom? Uh, OK. Safe drinking. What about you? You still got it? That's Sheila that was uh, announcing a love for you, and her husband was standing right beside her. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Roger, can I just tell you that you're my hall pass? What's hall pass mean? Like, the only person I would shoot on my husband Uh-oh. <laughs> Terrific. It's actually my hall pass. OK. Where's your Roger. husband? Is your husband's freaking? Right OK, yeah, no, we're sweet. He... Yeah, he's a boy. <laughs> <laughs> Right, are you going to mention that little surprise you brought into the cage for me? Are you still angry with that? I, uh, a little bit, yes. OK, I'm going to explain it again. It's not my fault. Remember, you were sitting down, you were quite bored. So I googled Magic Men of Brisbane. I thought he was a magician. I thought he was going to come in and do some magic tricks. Oh, he's the, he's the magician. The magi magician's here. Hello, mate. How you going? Hello, boys. Good, mate. What's your name? Will Bryan, for your information, he didn't do any magic tricks. Oh, didn't he? Didn't he just? Made his clothes disappear.
<laughs> Can you squat me? Squat me. Oh. Yes, go. Yeah. One. Two. Oh, it's really hot in here. Oh, didn't Gordon love it when you gave out his phone number, saying it was the stripper's number? Mm. Well, I'm here to help. Yes. <laughs> Basically, they put my number up and my phone hasn't stopped ringing. And unfortunately, none of the women are ringing me. It's all these fat blokes. After a minute, Brian, my favourite part of the whole two days when you dragged that annoying parrot fan in and went to town. I knew you were the worst person except in a parrot jersey. He was a f***ing punish. Turn off. Take pants off. Pants are off. Take shoes off. Draw a picture on his body. You know what really pissed me off is when you started giving away our succulent Chinese meal. Stop doing that. Stop doing that. Which is weird. Stop it. Stop it. The tiny ship was lost if it wasn't for the efforts of the fearless crew. The minnow would be lost. Once again, your gambling nearly killed us. What do you mean by that? Well, when you ask for money from the crowd so you could back a horse. There's more money coming in. Fletch, there's a 50. Well, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. No. Come on. Then you whipped him into a frenzy when the horse wins. Mm -hmm. At 14 to 1, mind you. The whole bloody cylinder nearly came crashing down. Yeah, no, it was a good idea, wasn't it? Because the security came over and told us to leave. So we could get out of that f***ing joint. Thank f*** that. No, no, no. We're coming back. No. We're coming back. But to end this crazy, or some say stupid, idea in style, we've come up with a montage that best sums up the most magical weekend on the Rugby League calendar. Enjoy and good night. Sing it, Nathan. Keep smiling. Mm. Keep shining. Mm. No. <laughs>